Hello CPS students. Today we're going to take a look at the Aspen Student Portal using an iPad or mobile device. Go to aspen.cps.edu in your browser and then type in your login ID as given to you by CPS. Not your email address but your login ID. Also use your CPS password to access your information. Once you've gone into the system, you will see academics and calendar icons, and you'll also see announcements coming from your principal or the district, as well as overdue assignments that may need attention. If we go to the hamburger icon at the top, we'll see other options, including academics. Academics screen will show your scheduled courses, the teachers assigned to those scheduled courses, and the cumulative grade that is currently in those teachers' grade books. If we look at the, we can look at current terms and past terms as well as the previous year as well and see those grades. If we drill into one of the courses, we can see what the teacher has uh, put together for a category and how you're doing versus cumulative average with that category, as well as the overall cumulative average, and then an attendance summary for that particular course. The calendar view will show all the assignments the teachers have in your gradebook in a color-coded manner that's currently in the teacher's gradebook. If we click on one of the courses, you'll see the course information, including the due date and the score of the particular uh, assignment based on what the teacher has put in the gradebook for your score. Finally, Pages is a feature that we'll be using in the future and teachers will have the option to create pages for their particular classes to exchange information and resources with the student as well. At this point this is future functionality that the teachers will choose to use. Finally you have an option to go to the web view under view full site. This will move you into the web view and give you additional functionality like viewing student fees or looking at graduation requirements for high school students. If you need more information, please go to cps.edu slash student portal to see some of the questions we have in the FAQ sections as well as video resources. Thank you.